everybody it got cold again big surprise and uh the field is frozen so i popped into the woods and i just got this little thing it's very interesting it looks pretty old i'm gonna brush it off and see uh what it looks like underneath i'll bring it right back in well this thing is pretty cool it appears to be some sort of uh like leather adornment. So those two hooks would have been pounded into some le leather and wrapped around and secured in place. Probably just a piece of horse tack, some little decoration or something, but it's pretty cool. I think it's old. I think it's fairly old. Like a couple hundred years old at least. But you never know. Hmm. Hopefully these woods have some other little hidden treasures in them. It's the first time I've been in these woods here. All right, I'll see you in the next signal. Oh, yes. Do you see what I see? This thing was deep. Whew. I'm pretty sure I got a coin. My first copper of the year. What do we got? That, my friends, is a King George II. Might be able to get a date off of this. Just gonna give it a gentle little wipe. Hmm. We'll see. I don't want to do too much to it. Oh man, it feels good. That feels good. <sighs> Sometimes it pays to go in the woods. First copper of the year. Yes. You can't tell me this isn't going to be a good spot to look for points. Look at that bank. Just cut all the gravel. Come on, snow melt. Well, I just pulled out a more modern find, but it's still got some age to it. Dog tag. 1959. Just popped it right out of this clump. I'll take that. Not quite a King George coin, but add that to my dog tag collection. What town is this? Wyndham? Hmm, not even in Wyndham. Cool. I'll keep going. Okay, so this is a perfect example of why you gotta dig every signal that you can. Because the signal that I pulled sounded just like all of these. And if you see that right there, baby. Yeah, nice thimble. I'm going to leave the dirt in that so it doesn't get crushed in, but that's beautiful. Nice little thimble. Sounded just like a shotgun shell or a little 22 casing. You never really know. I mean, if you can dig it, it took me two seconds. Just stick the shovel and pop it up. Boom. Awesome thimble. So what you gotta do, dig every single thing you can. Now I know this isn't really that old, but I'm on my way out of here. <laughs> Got a little saw. Pretty sure this is plastic. Whatever, I'll carry that with me. Okay, 
on the way out, almost at the car. And I got a, I think it was like a nine on the Equinox. I don't know if this is like a cut coin or just a piece of brass. It's definitely rounded. Oh, there we go. Hmm. It's definitely not a coin. It's probably a random piece of brass. I'll keep it though. Okay, everybody. No need really for a wrap up. We got the KG2. Date mm, to be determined. Might not be able to get one off of there. Either way, it's probably like mid 1700s. Could be a little bit earlier. But I love it. Got the old dog tag. 19. 58 1958 the old thimble random scrap brass random piece of leather decoration just to give you an idea <laughs> I dug all these shotgun shells for those few targets I did find a few pieces of wood that have signals in them I think they're more modern bullets lodged in there, but it's pretty cool. Got the old door handle or window knob. Kids these days don't even know what that is. <laughs> but until next time, stay safe, everybody. Okay, this is why I go metal detecting. You want to see my Whoa, finds? Oh, my. There, there's not much. <laughs> Look at this old coin. <laughs> you want to hold it? That's a King George II. It's so, it's so cold. Yeah, Daddy was out in the cold. Ooh, what was, what's this? It's what's a little this? decoration, probably on a little leather. Ooh, a necklace. It's a dog tag. A dog tag? Yeah, it goes on a dog collar. Oh, look at this. What is this thing? That's a thimble. Put it on your finger. Well, it's got dirt in it. Daddy will clean it. Oh. You like this coin? Ooh, what is that? That is trash. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Whoa. This is awesome. I've been touching dirt. What do you want to say to the camera? To, you, to YouTube. This is beautiful.